All right guys, back again. Um, I didn't really do an intro yesterday. It was the first day I had this. Um, so I kind of want to run down who I am and kind of what I got going on. My name is Joey Rhodes. Um, I'm from the Quad Cities. Uh, I got three kids. I got uh, two boys and one girl. A couple years ago, I was going through Barber College. It was right after or, I mean, kind of during the COVID thing. And um, I paid the money, went through it, graduated, did my thing. I didn't really enjoy it, but during the course of that, um, there was a man named Josh Basala, and he opened up the Sneaker Vault QC on the Avenue of the Cities, and it was right down the street from the shop, right two minutes away from my house, and it was like God sent this place to me. The owner actually thought that I was one of his old buddies, so he thought that I was somebody that he used to hang out with back in the day. Little did he know I was not that guy. I thought maybe it was my dad. My dad's got the same name as me, but obviously that wasn't it. So we had started over, and I thought he hit me up just for shoes. You know, he knew he knew I was in the shoe game. Um, prior to this, I had like 13, 14, you know, 15 years experience buying, selling, trading sneakers just out of my truck. Um, so I had already had my reputation built. I just didn't really uh, have like a solid platform. And I started hanging around him a lot. Um, I got a lot of good stuff from that guy. He's an amazing dude. Um, he's doing vintage now, but slowly but surely he let me start to become a part of the shop more and more and more and it really became like a part of me and I became a part of it and we became family and yeah um, he ended up starting a new business heating and air conditioning um, he's doing great but he didn't have time for the shop obviously so I I bought it then you know a few months into me having it I kind of figured you know I'm gonna need to get something better and more upgraded so I moved to North Park Mall here in Davenport um, Iowa. You guys will see everyday stuff. You guys will see, you know, my sales, what I'm buying. You'll see interactions throughout the day. Like I'm in the mall, so I see a lot of different people. Um, I'm gonna try to do some the one ship challenges. See if I can't spread some money around. Maybe some raffles, stuff like that. Um, I love giving back too. So um, I also like wheeling and dealing. So if you guys are in the shop, you know, throw me an offer on something. I'm always looking to wheel and deal. But yeah, man. Um, so yeah, just some context on. I just wanted to give you guys a little bit about me where I came from stuff like that so yeah enjoy the footage my guys they'd be like 220 they'd be like 220 230 if they were thirsty it's kind of it is what it is man that's why the price is so low so I mean I do you do 120 I can do 120 yeah I mean, I, I don't you know. You do 120? I can do 120. Are you going to take them? I mean, should I? It's up to you. You're wearing them, not me. That's what the fuck I keep telling them. Like, why do we go to every store and ask me? I don't know. I'm not wearing these shoes. You are. We're here. I really appreciate it. Have a good day. Thank you. Yeah. Boy. About the people when you can. You don't. See, you don't get a lot of chances to do that. You know what I mean? Like. You that money. Yeah, yeah. You don't always, you are not always going to have a chance to help somebody out. So when that rare time comes, and you can do even a little bit, like taking 30 $40 off a shoe, um, and that could have just been a story or whatever, but like it makes me feel better. It makes me feel like I did something, and uh, it, it, it will help you. It will help you too. Even if it's something so little, like ho holding the door for somebody or something like that, guys. Doing things good for others will bring you goodness, good feelings. I don't know. I don't know how to say it. It's like good karma. You know what I mean? I've got a, uh, I've actually got a stash back here of shoes that I want to give away for free to people that actually need them. Not no resellers that are trying to make a little extra money. Um, just, just, just in case, you know, if, if I get a kid that comes in and it's just looking like, you know, mom's like, we can't, we can't afford that. And you, you just, you can kind of see it sometimes. And I'm not saying I, I judge people or anything like that, but um, I don't know. Helping people is good, guys. Just saying. Got a guy coming in um, with a bunch of pairs, so I think he's just gonna drop them off. We work on price later on. Ah, just on time. Checking on in. Trying to get I see content. people with that too. Yeah. Do you want them down here or like? Uh, we can. Yeah, we can go in here. Yeah. You say you got everything on list, yeah. ready to go. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Some good stuff. Nice, nice. Yeah, most of the.
Alright guys, just got some more pandas in, size 9. The lady uh, did not want to be videoed, but she ordered them for her daughter. Got the wrong size, so she had to redo them. So, I but, tried these on, I kick it, and I think I need to try them on again. Just, okay. They're going to feel the same. I know, but <laughs> I just, I just got to put them on my feet to see if I want. Okay, I'll tell you 250 when we were there. I think, yeah, so I can do that for you. Is that your school colors? Oh, shit. Anybody want, a, anybody want a free nickel? I just don't want to pick it up because it's on tails. And then that penny's on tails over there too. That's why I was like, I can't do it. Can't. You just leave them? <laughs> yeah, I just leave them. Fire. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's your school colors? Yeah. We have, to wear, we have to wear a uniform too, so. Oh, bro, that's even more lit. <laughs> yeah, I got you, bro. Let me go grab the other one for you. What you doing cash or card, my guy? Let's just do cash. Do cash? Yeah. Alright, 250, no tax, man. How much could you buy the jaw one? If you want a free one, bro, I can do one of these three right here. Like the Dior. Or I'll the, take the like, Dior. Okay, cool. Alright, thanks. Bro. Just because I got multiples, yeah. you know what I mean? Thank you. Yep, yep. Yeah. Or you just make a purchase I'll, I'll and you get a free one. You want the off-white joint? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Seven bucks. I got change. So every other shoe that I have in shop is just gonna have the right shoe out. But of course, these. How do you even post these? How do you put them on the shelf? Like, how does it work? You know what I mean? Cause you, it's like here. There's both pairs. The only reason like you only have one pair out here is obviously so people can't steal stuff. But what would you do if you went to go buy this shoe? And you get outside and you look in your shoebox and you got a red one in there. You know what I mean? Like, how do I explain that to somebody? Um, he's got a pair of uh, DS Thunder Force. Yeah. How much did you pay for the 12s? You got them on you? They're in the car. Hey, appreciate it, bro. Yeah, yeah, be smooth, man. Uh, Thunders, right? Yeah. Red or regular? Red. I was thinking about the dumps, but I was going to see how much cash you give me first. Um, cash would be around $2, 220 Store credit like 240 uh, Just depending. Uh, would you trade the, the dumps, the UNC uh, yeah, those, those dumps? Yeah, it's UNC. Let me see it. Let me see what I got on them. You got them at 260 Yeah, you can make a purchase too, didn't you? Um, yeah. All right, so we're doing the receipts of this. Yeah, okay. Some Thunder 4s, size 12, definitely a size I need. If you have any more size 12 for sale, yeah. bring it to me. We're definitely coming back. You guys got good yeah. stuff. For the pre owned 11 and a half, I just got these yesterday. <laughs> I was wondering when you got these. It's got your extra laces in there. Get you bagged you up. YouTube? I do, bro. I just, the vault? Yeah, the Secret Vault QC. Okay. Yeah. You got IG too? Yep. No, it's, it's the same as the Secret Vault QC. Alright, you want to sign a pick and then I'll I can Definitely, get bro. Oh, yeah. How are you doing? Good, how are we doing? Hey, who owns the store? Me. You I do. do. Yeah, what's up? What's your name, man? Joey. Man. Yeah. You like it? <laughs> like, the only thing I, I'm, I think of, like, when I see something like this, and I know this is small right now, but it's Barkins, man. Yeah. Oh, man, that's crazy, because, look. This place could take off. Here. Look. Bring them into me. That's all? That's it? Yeah. And I'm just buying every single one. Buying everything I can. Either that or this is, million, this is million, 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 million dollar business right here. Sooner or later. Hey, you took my idea, dog. I promise you. My, my, yeah, I know. You already know what's going to happen. Hell yeah, bro. For sure, man. I'm going to come get your number before I leave, all right? All right, bro. I appreciate it. So every time I get a new sneaker, I mark it, I get a tag ready for it. Um, it's called bagging and tagging. So the top is gonna be DS or pre, obviously that's dead stock or pre-owned. You guys know what that means, I hope. Um, if not, DS means dead stock, which is never worn or you know maybe tried on or something like that. Pre-owned is just gonna be worn, you know, obviously by somebody else. Um, style, I put Dunks, or I put J1, J2, J3, so on and so forth, or Air Max, or Travis Scott, or something like that. Then I put the size, price, and on the back I have like my own system. So I have like my own way of doing inventory. So I have seven racks. 
one through seven, and I go like so rack one, and then this is one, two, three, four, five. So this one I put at two five, so rack two on level five. So that is the size 13 uh, blue Shishiko dunk that I just bought right there. So people are going by and they're like looking in here, like, who the f is he talking to? <laughs> I start on Instagram, then I do Facebook, then I do uh, Snapchat. So this is my dunk wall over here. You can see I had a bunch of pandas. I had a lot of pandas, guys. Pandas just went crazy this past week. I've had 30-something pairs. I have four pairs left. Um, and I like to go through, and sometimes my tags are sticking to the side. I like to flip them right. Just so people can see it, they don't gotta like wonder like, oh, how much is this? Or they have a seven and a two, but you know, we know from the video earlier that seven two is my uh, inventory number. So there's the hats, kind of my memorabilia. Everybody always likes to see this stuff here. Um, some old older pairs, like the original gears they came out. Everybody thinks they're worn by Jordan or something like that. I'm like, dude, it's a size eight, I think. <laughs> I think you wore a size 12 and a half, 13. But, but yeah, I got a bunch of cool stuff in here, guys. If you guys are ever in the Quad City area, Davenport, um, I'm at North Park Mall. Finally made it to a mall. But yeah, I gotta get the price on this. I think I'm doing 160. Like I said, I bought them for 120. So I'll be able to profit 40 bucks. A lot of people with a size 13, 14, um, they really have troubles finding shoes. I, I've noticed anything above a 13, 14, 15, people really, um, they really appreciate if you have their size, but it's kind of hard to keep that stuff in stock. This is my DS wall. This is everything that's brand new. Lots of good stuff. Um, obviously, it's a little, little bare right now because it is back to school season, and let me tell you, back to school season is crazy. Then I got my pre-owned wall, which is very bare right now. Normally, it's pretty it's pretty stacked up. Um, I've normally got it all filled. I've got a few pairs that are in, in cleaning right now. And uh, once they take a couple days, I have a great a great shoe cleaner. Um, I I used to have them on contract, but we we decided to go shoe for shoe just because there's some months that I don't do anything, and there's some months where I have 30 pairs I need cleaned. Um, so yeah, that's the pre-owned section, and then I've got some more, some more hats, just some fill-in stuff, you know, some cool stuff to look at. Oh yeah, got the Jeff Hamilton, the original Jeff Hamilton up there. That thing is like 80 pounds, I swear. Then I got the poster here. Everybody always comes up to it, see how tall they are. As you guys can see, I'm short. Yeah, got the heat case, which is pretty bare right now. Got some good stuff in there. I had some Travis Scotts that, that sold yesterday at the 2015 Chicago's. Got the uh, um, the Brooklyn Off-White Air Force Ones and the Shattered Backboards. Got the Yeezys Originals down there. Some more cool stuff. Got some Kobe's and the Just Dawn Arctic Pink. That is a sample pair. So you can see maybe you can see it maybe you can't you can see the uh, sample tag in there a couple other things some books just stuff for people to look at a bunch of good stuff guys um, I, ju I just got them i mean they're already under retail retail is 180 plus tax yeah i know that's, that's brand new pay yeah. so yeah so 150 is about the best i can do if you do the cash i can do no tax yeah i'll do that yeah yeah, yeah we'll do that Check Sir. Like, don't. Hey, this one. This one. Dude might have you know, had it in his house or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, it's legal on the other side of the room. Right, sure is. Just because it was oh. the box is going to sit now. Yeah. What are these? Yeah. That's too strong. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, everybody loves the Travis Scott poster. It's like uh, Jordan's old poster for Bose, I think it was, or something like that. 
Got the Just Dawn shorts, all brand new. I've, I've got a guy that has 30, 40 pairs of these, all brand new, never worn. So if anybody's interested, let me know. They're all 2XL. Those are 2XL. Um, yeah, so this is my little spot. I'm gonna try to get some content, get some, get some people to eat some chips, see what we can do for you guys. But, uh, but yeah, stay tuned. Probably gonna have some more people in today. Um, I'll try to do buyouts with you guys. Um, so you guys can kind of see how I get my stuff and, you know, and learn or however, you know, and maybe, uh, maybe I can help you guys or you guys can help me. So stay tuned.